It's my pleasure tonight to tell you that 82 year old Claudette Colvin is no longer a convicted juvenile delinquent. Now, truthfully speaking, she never was anything of the sort. She was a 15 year old girl who refused to give up her seat on the bus to Jim Crow, a nonviolent act of defiance that earned her an arrest for assault on a Montgomery, Alabama police officer and an unjust label that she carried for 66 years. It's a legendary story for the fight for civil rights, a black woman arrested for refusing to give up her seat to a white passenger. The thing is, her arrest came nine months before Rosa Parks, and it was downplayed because she was pregnant. The leaders of the movement couldn't abide the face of it being a pregnant 15-year-old girl. But neither age nor pregnancy kept her from listening to the ancestors when she was told to get up. I said... I could not move because history had me glued to the seat. And they said, how is that? I said, well, it felt as though Harriet Tubman hands were pushing me down on one shoulder and Sojourner Truth hand was pushing me down on the other shoulder. When they call, you answer. Pregnant or not, Miss Claudette would continue marching in the battle for civil rights. In fact, she was one of the four defendants in the case that ended bus segregation in Alabama. She lived her life, raised her children, but the label was always there. Delay justice until Judge Calvin Williams erased it. On behalf of myself and all of the judges of Montgomery, offer my apology for an injustice that was perpetrated upon you. It is a beautiful story a shining portrait of America made even brighter by the fact that it came just a day after Governor Ron DeSantis twisted the words of a civil rights forefather as he introduced legislation to further ban the teachings of critical race theory in Florida. Another very American portrait. What he and others of his mindset, including the governor-elect of Virginia, right here for instance, what they seem to want is a ban on the teaching of the history that Claudette Colvin is a part of. Claudette Colvin, Sojourner Truth, Harriet Tubman, and all the rest of these famous and nameless whose stories make up the fabric of America. Contrary to warped opinions, this history enriches us all and should be taught to all before it and its lessons are lost. So congratulations to you, Claudette Colvin, and thank you for your bravery. You set an example we should all aim to follow, starting with making sure your story and those of others like it are told.